Hello everyone, my name is Cristian Negulescu. You know me for a lot of automation on the YouTube um, for you iPad. Last time we created something very nice with ChatGPT. So ChatGPT will be able to call a new iPad robot. Today we'll do the, um, the same stuff, but with a different use case. We'll be able to build a document using the ChatGPT. So I have here inside of, um, uh, you, uh, of Google Documents on G Drive. On G Drive, I have a document. So let's say that it's a request for leave of absence. And here we have start date, end date variable, reason for for the request in my name. And you have a document with uh, UiPath template and so on. Good. Um, so the idea is like this. I will go to ChatGPT. I built here another GPTs. And I will give him this comment. Control C. Control V. So, hi, Florin, I'm Christian, and I want to take a holiday of uh, for 10 working days, starting from uh, 25th of uh, um, uh, July, yeah? So, the system an analyzed the data, and uh, he extracted the data, and he said he wants to uh, confirm the action. So, the system will, will start an action. The action means that um, the system will go and start a new iPad process. So here on the jobs, we'll see that uh, uh, ChatGPT was able to communicate via uh, uh, webhooks, like I showed you on the last video, and I will detail a little here. Uh, um, he will create uh, via webhooks, he's able to call the UiPath robot and provide the information to the UiPath robot. So the um, uh, ChatGPT was able to extract this data. So from the text that uh, I provide you, which is simple text, very simple text, he was able to identify the start date, the end date, the request, the reason for the request, and my name, yeah. And he will uh, send this data to the UiPath robot. UiPath robot will be able to modify the document. He will make a copy of this document. He will create a new document and um, uh, he will... Um, uh, complete the template for the for that new document, and after he cre create the new document, the system will be able to send me an um, probably this one, the leaf tree. Uh, so the system will send me an email with uh, the address of the document. But uh, let's see if the robot finished. So the robot finished. Now um, uh, the system uh, uh, from G Drive will send me an uh, an um, email to notify me on. Uh, uh, on your iPad, uh, uh, on Christian, on your iPad.com. Oh, look, I have the email. So I have the email. I receive here an email that uh, I have a document from your iPad tutorials, Christian Negoles, which is my account on, on this one. And now we'll see the document. And you see that in the document, the robot, uh, the chat GPT was able to extract the data. And your iPad robot was able to complete all this data. So I want a leave back and from work from July 2000 uh, to this one from uh, July to August to 8th of August and um, the request is for holiday and I'm Christian yeah good so I have the full document let's see what I have inside of the UiPath process and what I have on ChatGPT it's uh, the same that I showed you last time but I will, I will uh, we'll talk a little on this one so on the UiPath um, system I create a workflow that it's created here on uh, Studio M to be faster so I have like the last one, I have a uh, webhook. So the trigger of this workflow, it's a webhook. I have the uh, link for the webhook that I complete inside of the ChatGPT uh, uh, schema. I provide him a schema for uh, for demo. Then I will copy the file. So I copy, um, I go to G Drive and I make a copy of the request file to a new leave and I put a random number. So I create a, a, a new file. And on, then I have this uh, new <clears throat> new function that it's field document template. Yeah. So this field document template was able to identify that uh, I have here um, um, ten uh, four variables, and I cop I complete these variables with um, uh, data extracted from the JSON that is coming from ChatGPT. And after I do this stuff, uh, I just say that I want to share um, the file or the folder, the file that I work. I want to share it with um, uh, Christian Neculescu at UAP.com. Yeah, so that uh, that was the procedure for the robot to be able to copy them, uh, to make a, 
copy of the template to be able to fill the variables from the template and to be able to share this one. This one which share the variables from the template is very nice. I will show you the function. So it's fill uh, document template. You will go here on, uh, on this one. You select your document. Uh, let's say uh, we'll select the, the request one to, to see how it's working. That's the idea. So we'll select the request for leave, save. Yeah, and um, here you have to put the documents field with conditions. So you say here that uh, you have the symbol, in my case, this is one for the variables. And the system is able to identify exactly the variables that I have. So, so we'll go inside of the document. He will filter all the uh, uh, all the text that is between uh, that um, um, parentheses, and he will identify the variables very well. So it's very easy to to work with this one. Yeah. And inside of ChatGPT, as usual, I like uh, I said I have this video where I have full configuration. I created GPTs, and on this GPT, I will uh, show you the um, configuration that I have for this GPT. So on this GPT, on the instruction, I say please analyze the document, and if you decide that it's a leave request, you have to extract start date, end date, reason for the request, your name, and here I build a schema. I get using ChatGPT here. I put the webhook, so I put the um, the webhook from here, yeah. And ChatGPT build me the uh, all the variables. So we start date, end date, reason for the request, and so on. I will put in the description of the movie, like uh, like I put on on the last movie. I will put exactly my schema, and uh, you will be able to build your own schema. Uh, with this one, yeah. So you have here on the description of the movie, you will have also the, the schema, yeah. And you build your modify your own schema with uh, with ChatGPT. So that's the idea. From a simple request, that is, it was a really basic request, yeah. To an uh, uh, from a simple request directly to an uh, uh, a full document that you are very able to read. You just remember that I say, hey, Florin, I'm Christian, and I want to take a holiday for 10 working days starting from this one, that one. So it was very, very simple. Okay, so um, as usual, thank you very much for watching. If you have any ideas, please comment to the movies, like the movies and tell me what else you want to see on this channel. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe. Have a good one. Bye bye.